Adele Laurie Blue Adkins was born in 1988 and raised in London by a single mother. In her early teens, Adele began to consider a music career. While she attended a secondary school for the performing arts, a friend posted her songs on MySpace. In 2006, shortly after graduating, Adele signed a recording contract. Quotes by Adele Heartbreak can definitely give you a deeper sensibility for writing songs. I drew on a lot of heartbreak when I was writing my first album, I didn't mean to but I just did. I don't really need to stand out, there's room for everyone. Although I haven't built a niche yet, I'm just writing love songs. I doubt I'll be singing forever, because at some point people aren't going to want to hear my music, and I hope that I'll still get the opportunity to write songs. I think it's shameful when you sell out. It depends what kind of artist you want to be, but I don't want my name anywhere near another brand. I'm like Johnny Cash. I only wear black. I've never had a problem with the way I look. I'd rather go for lunch with my friends than go to a gym. Let the sky fall, when it crumbles, we will stand tall, face it all together. The scars of your love remind me of us they keep me thinking that we almost had it all the scars of your love they leave me breathless I can't help feeling we could have had it all. You have to prioritize what you stress about when you have a child. Don't underestimate the things that I will do. I don't make music for eyes. I make music for ears. I don't have time to worry about something as petty as what I look like. I love hearing my audience breathe. I won't let you close enough to hurt me. I've never been more normal than I am now. Sometimes my songs wander off a bit and are not always coherent. Whenever I'm about to eat meat I always see my little dog's eyes. I don't like going to the gym. I can't dance to save my life. I've always written down how I feel. A drunk tongue is an honest one in my opinion. I am never writing a breakup record again, by the way. I'm done with being a bitter witch. I want to go and see things as a fan again. I am a fan, but I can't remember what it feels like to be a fan anymore. Because I've become an artist. I've become the artist. In the songs I can still be really really direct but in interviews when I'm explaining my songs I shouldn't be so direct about who they're about. Be brave and fearless to know that even if you do make a wrong decision, you're making it for a good reason. I don't write songs about a specific, elusive thing. I write about love, and everyone knows what it is like to have your heart broken. I like having my hair and face done, but I'm not going to lose weight because someone tells me to. I make music to be a musician not to be on the cover of Playboy. I've got some news. I'm delighted to announce that Simon and I are expecting our first child together. I wanted you to hear the news direct from me, obviously we're over the moon. If I were a writer and not a singer in 10 years, I don't know how I'd feel about writing really personal songs and getting someone else to sing them. Americans are always mortified when I tell them this, but in England, it's a tradition to put your plaques and photographs and awards and gold records and stuff in your bathroom. I don't know why. 
I don't want to be in everyone's face. I'm a big music fan, and I get really pissed off when it gets like that and I don't want people to get like that with me. I've never wanted to look like models on the cover of magazines. I represent the majority of women and I'm very proud of that. 